just want to give a shout out to these three people that was the first to comment on my last video thank you for the love and the support and i also want to give a special shout out to our new team members thank you for supporting my channel it means a lot to me thank you hey 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 this is your mama couponer and right now i'm finally getting to doing a reaction of the lady that got arrested um doing the i mean trying to buy the penny items at walmart now i'm still finding penny items you know for the people that want to say it's a glitch i'm still finding penny items i go to my local walmart almost every day and i find a penny item literally every day okay um but uh i do i said i was going to do a reaction i did a poll here's the result to the poll so at least 60 like 60 some percent said hey we want to see a reaction so i'm going to go ahead and do a reaction now ray they said because i don't know if ray a he or she so <laughs> ray uh want me to do a reaction on um a fight at dollar tree so if i could find that video i'm going to i will see if i can do a reaction to that <laughs> but right now we just gonna go hang into it because i try to speed this along because it's two parts and it's like 17 minutes long yeah, so I did speed it along to make it a little under 15 minutes. So we're going to go ahead and jump right to it because, of course, I'm going to begin my response and my opinion. So it's going to make it a little longer than the 15 minutes. So let's go ahead and get to it, okay? Okay, guys, so I'm going to share one line. We're trying to close. They used for three cents. They don't want to sell it. They lay it. They don't want to sell it. Oh, no, she didn't. Did she hit her? Did she hit her? I don't know. That hand was a little too close for my for my comfort. Uh, I, that, that hand was a little too close for my comfort. Okay, I don't know. Maybe it was just the way she just tapped the camera because she didn't want her to be recorded. But the hand was a little too close. And see, I got a reflex. Okay? <laughs> I got a reflex. I feel like she's trying to put hands on somebody. So I think I would have been laying hands on her too and asked the Lord to forgive me in advance before I go to jail. See, I would have already been in jail. <laughs> so let's go ahead. I'm going to go ahead. But so far, woo. Okay, the hand was a little too close for my for me, but anyway, let's keep on going. Was this that. a police officer? Well, Ooh, she take that bed. Yeah, she pulling it. Hey, Mama, she got her hand on that bed. Yeah, you ain't getting that bed. That police officer said, "I'm off shelf. I I want nothing to do with this." She walked right on out. <laughs> that police officer, I swear to God, she got her hand on that bed. Did you not match up? I'm off. Yeah, she got her hand on that bed. Yeah, she got her hand on that bed. Yeah, she got her Okay. They say something in the system. They pulling me all over. They pulling my car. They even pull it with my purse. So we in Walmart here in Florida. Oh, this happened in Florida. in Florida. And they're refusing to sell the clothes. Yeah, it was already on there for sale. Mm -hmm. And they didn't remove it. No, they so didn't. Now they refusing to, to sell it. Ooh, they already yeah. got an officer? No, I, I, I could record. I'm free to record. I'm free to record. Listen, this stuff is for sale. It wasn't the rats. Okay, y'all please explain to me what they mean by private business. Maybe I'm having a moment. Because people, I took notice that a lot of, um, managers they will say oh you can't you can't record because um uh, walmart is a private business or they will say it's privately owned can someone please explain that to me because <laughs> I'm, I'm i'm a little confused on that because walmart is recording you as soon as you come in the store so that means it's fair game 
you know, so that means you can record in the store because Walmart is recording you as soon as you come in the store uh, without you saying, yes, you want to be recorded or no, you don't. So it's fair game. <laughs> it's fair game. So I don't understand what's up because that's what um when I was, when the lady didn't want to sell me the three cent item, she also said that Walmart is privately owned. So that being said, my corporate, what the number that I'm calling for corporate is not the same number, same corporate that they have to answer to because it's pri because Walmart is privately owned. And I don't understand this privately owned thing. Can someone please explain it to me? What's up with this privately owned thing? Explain it to me. And then I want to know how, I also I have another question. How long was this going on? Because this manager came with a police ready, like, he wasn't with it. He was like came with the police and break the saddle. <laughs> so was they fussing about this before she started recording? Because it's kind of crazy for you to audit. You said tell her that she came back at three cent item. She want to know why. And your first instinct is to call nine one one and say and call the police for to escort her. Or you, how long was? <sighs> I need to know how long was y'all going back and forth about these three cent items before you decided to call the police because that police is just staying. Is, you, the manager, the guy came there with the police on deck. <laughs> Maybe it's just me. I need to know how long was this conversation going before you already had the police ready. When people stealing, y'all don't even have the police on standby like that. The police, they be able to run off with the stuff and everything. So I want to know. How this police was there so quickly? So, let me know. Maybe y'all got the, uh, oh, and I also forgot. I forgot something. I want to put the person on TikTok that this from. I forgot all about that. So, let me put that right here while running my mouth. So, let me all uh, know how, if you know how long she was in the store. If anybody know that before police was called. Because this seemed kind of quick to me. Did they have the police on stand back? And they refuse to sell it. You, you should remove it from the racks. You shouldn't remove it because I'm not trying to steal it. I'm trying to pay for it. True. She's not trying to steal it. This, this, this was in the racks for sale. It was on the racks. Let me remove this. No, 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 no. Don't remove it. Don't remove it. Don't remove it. Okay, ma'am, put your phone down. Why are they removing it? officer i don't like this officer i'm being real because it seems like the officer is not opening to even listening to her side at all it's like he came in automatically on their side like you're supposed to listen to both sides of the story she's saying that she went she went to get the clothes off the rack the clothes was on the floor okay they wrong up for three cents and they is not allowing her to purchase it and they call you Okay, to to me, this is not a reason to call me. If I was an officer, I would have said, why are y'all calling me? Oh, because she went to buy these clothes. Well, where was the clothes at? On the floor. How much was the clothes? Um, they three cents. And the lady is saying, these clothes should have been taken off the floor if they not on sale for the three cents the lady so the, then the worker she gonna say oh we've been trying to do that all morning and here's the customer saying well y'all miss all of these clothes and i'm just trying to purchase it y'all the one had them on the floor the officer officer all that he's saying is well they saying that the clothes is not three cents they didn't say that the clothes wasn't three cents they didn't say the clothes wasn't three cents they saying that they've been trying to get all the clothes all morning and they just, I guess, decide to stop trying or they didn't see all of those clothes that she had in her basket. 
I don't like this officer because he he biased. He came in already on their side, and I don't like that. I I, I don't like it. I'm I'm telling you, I don't like it. To me, he biased. He came in already on the employee side, not even really listening to what she's saying. To me, this is not even worth you calling the police on, I mean, the police, because she wasn't trying to steal nothing. She didn't do nothing wrong. If he would have went to the store and picked up an item that was, that he thought maybe was $5 and it went to the register in the wrong up three cents and he said, oh, okay, and tried to pay and they said, oh, no, you can't pay it because we were supposed to take these items off the shelf and let me call the police officer just in case you get mad and you want to buy it anyway. He would look at them like they were crazy. I feel like he's biased. I don't like. I I don't like it. I don't like it. Now he he's, the manager is trying to get her to release the basket. She's refusing to release the basket. He gonna say it's their item. It's not the employee's item. Corporate not one time said that if these customers grab these items and try to purchase it, that you cannot sell it for. That was a decision that the managers decided. Because it made them look bad because they were supposed to do their job and they didn't do their job. Okay? So, he gonna say it's their item. It's not, it's not the employee's item. Corporate didn't say that it wasn't that you didn't have to say that you couldn't sell it. If they don't want to sell it to you, they don't have to. Where do that say that in the policy? See, I would have asked, can they show me that in the policy? Because it's not their item, it's corporate. And what do this mean? Somebody please explain to me. Maybe I'm having a slow moment. What do it mean when they say that Walmart is privately owned? Because I, I heard that a lot lately. It's, this is a private owned business. If we don't want to sell it, we don't have to. It's a private owned business. Your, the corporate you call it is not the same corporate that we answer to. I need to know what this private owned business means. Uh, maybe I'm having a moment. Explain this to me in the comment section, okay? Explain this to me, okay? <laughs> Go ahead. Okay, I got to go to the next one. Go ahead. 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 Go Okay, now I have to admit this. I wouldn't have done that. <laughs> I would not be in the middle of the store talking to so TikTok people. TikTok. TikTok people. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I would not have done that. Okay. Okay. I would not be like TikTok. <laughs> Listen to me. People. Listen. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know she was upset and maybe she just reacted because, you know, she was upset. But I don't think I would have done that. <laughs> because at the end of the day, none of these customers is going to help you. Uh, they're not going to do anything. They're not going to, you know, they're not. They're not going to do anything. If anything, they're going to look at you. They might pull out their phone and record it too, you know. But they're not going to help you at all. <laughs> they not you know to be honest i don't even think a lot of the customers that was there even understood you know what was going on <laughs> they just either they they the way they you know put her out there is like she did something wrong and they had to call the police they're going to do something you know they trying to you know reprimand her maybe i'm using that word wrong but anyway <laughs> they trying to get at you know Punish her for whatever that she did that they consider wrong. Basically, back, trying to buy the three cent item. But these are other shoppers that don't know what's going on. They don't. They probably thought that she tried to steal the clothes or she didn't scan all her items, you know. And they caught her not scanning all her items. They don't know really what's going on, you know. 
So I don't think none of them is going to help her <laughs> at all. So I don't think I would have took that route to be yelling in the middle of the floor saying, you know, TikTok, someone help me. You see bully. I, I don't think I would have done that. I think that calls more attention, but you know, that's me. Accusing me of trespassing. Oh, please take Please don't kill me. Help me I don't on think my I friends. Okay. Oh my. <laughs> and the man said nobody's gonna help you. Florida Jesus. No, 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 no
He should have just let her leave. Okay? She didn't get her stuff. They basically banning her from the store, got saying that she's trespassing because she found all these three cent items that she tried to purchase. So that's enough to, to get in the, and I felt like she should have went in the car and called corporate and explained the situation to corporate, tell, tell them that she had proof and all the other stuff and have it documented, got it recorded and everything. I think she should have had left. But, but now... He's not even allowing her to leave because he said that he got to have it documented that she was trespassing. When she wasn't trespassing, she she was trying to shop. I haven't done nothing wrong. You know I haven't done nothing wrong, right? I haven't done nothing wrong. I haven't done nothing wrong. I haven't done nothing wrong. He's going to add another charge because she didn't give her ID. Okay, I, I, I could check there. You don't move. No, she can't move. Yeah, she can't okay. leave now. I'm sorry. <laughs> the please help me. I like, help me. Nobody's going to help you. <laughs> He should just have let her leave. This is wrong. I'm sorry for keep stopping this because this trespassing thing is really getting under my skin. So he basically saying, she said, I didn't do anything wrong. He said, well, you get, you, yes, you did. You trespassed. As if she wasn't allowed to come to the store prior to her coming to the store. Like she came to the store when she knew she was trespassing or she wasn't allowed to. Maybe I need to look up the trespassing law, making sure I'm saying something and maybe I'm the one not understanding. Okay. If I'm not, if I'm the one not understanding, I'm open to learning. Okay, just put it in the comment section below. It, 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 because I feel, I, this almost feel like they didn't have nothing. That she really didn't do anything wrong. And they just threw the trespassing at her. At her, You know, like, who else going to say she was trespassing? Yeah. Because she, she caused a scene with 83 cent items. So, to get back at her, we're going to say she was trespassing. But anyway, I'm going to let the rest play through. I'm going to try not to stop. Okay, I'm going to try not to stop. Because we do still got a good 60 minutes to go. I haven't What's done anything. The, 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 the place is open. You can either give me ID. Listen, you give I don't give me ID. Don't give me ID. I don't give me ID. Just for no reason. Oh my God. I'm getting, I'm getting a reason for no reason. You've been detained. I've been detained for no reason. Please help me. Help me. Somebody, please. Please. Oh my God. Look, look how he's, he's hurting me. He's hurting me because they, I tried to purchase something. Oh, my God, please, help me, somebody. Chances, right? somebody. Oh, look at him. He's uh, so the girl recording. He's so Give me your hand. Give me your hand. Please, please, please. Hold this one. Give me your hand. You can record. I'm recording this one. Let's go. Oh, 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 you're hurting me. Oh, my God. Oh, my Lord.
Oh, he asked a question. Was he scared? Let me go. So you're in the ocean, you're a federal agent, right? Yes. Is she? Do y'all know? Is she for real? It doesn't matter. Why do you matter? Well, now you're impersonating a federal agent. And you're also impersonating a federal agent. Okay, perfect. Let me give you my ID and you're in trouble. You better have that. Ooh. Okay. This is part two. I don't want you in the army. Okay. How long were you in the army? How long were you in the army? Let me go. You say you're in the army and you're a federal agent, right? Yes. How long were you in the army? What it matters. It doesn't matter. What it matters. You he seemed a little worried. <laughs> he seemed scared, Captain. Okay, perfect. Let me give you my ID and you're in trouble. You better have that. I'm not going to be nice. I'm trying to be nice with you. I'm not going to be nice with you. I'm not going to be nice with you. Okay. Now, this is the thing about it. When he said, I tried, to, she said, I tried to leave. And he said, well, I gave you a whole lot of chances to leave. At the beginning, she was, she, she did, was like, she didn't, she didn't understand why she had to leave when it was a public place. She didn't do nothing wrong. She didn't understand why she had to leave. Okay. So yes, at first she, you know, she was like, no, she shouldn't have to leave. But when he said that he was going to basically charge her with trespassing or, you know, she, he was going to, you know, arrest her if she she didn't leave, she did say several times, let me leave. So she did try to leave, okay? That officer can say what he want. She did try to leave. Once, you know, he said that, you know, she could be arrested. But then he said that he had to do paperwork and that she had to be charged for trespassing. Okay, so she did say let her leave several times after he said that, he, that, you know, at the beginning, at the beginning, she was like, she didn't understand why she had to leave. She was saying it was a public place. She don't understand why she had to leave. She didn't do nothing wrong. But then when he, you know, made it clear that she can be arrested or detained, okay, <laughs> she was trying to leave several times and he was the one that told her that she could not leave. So I don't know if he, he forgot that quick or the fact that she said that she was in the military and all this other stuff just got him a little scared. <laughs> but he did tell her that she couldn't leave. he a little worried about that um officer thing <laughs> i think he a little worried about that because i think he know that he didn't do everything by the book he did not do no he did not he didn't he he, he, he sound a little scared scared because he didn't do everything by the book his own self mm -mm. that's crazy okay we don't have long we don't have long and i think i um she also showed some pictures 
of like um bruises that she got from that arrest. they're going to interrogate her. I think that's when you only can read. You have to read them um, Miranda rights. That's the end of part two. Now, this is her showing pictures of the bruises. Woo, that looked terrible. That's her showing the bruises that she got from that um, arrest. Oh, my God. To be honest, I feel like she do have a lawsuit. Yeah, don't, don't mind my little mess back here. But <laughs> I feel like she have a lawsuit. I do. I do. I, I I feel like she have a lawsuit. I feel like, number one, the officer came in biased. He didn't really want to hear what she had to say. He, he already was on the side of the employees. Okay? He was already on the side. He didn't even hear when the employees admitted that... Um, the item was three cent and they were supposed to remove the items and they failed to do so and that it was they was working on it in the morning and they just didn't get the chance to pretty much take them all off and she was like well y'all miss all of this and that's what I'm trying to purchase these items that y'all miss it's not my fault that y'all didn't um have time to pull these items off the shelves and all he could say is that um well, they, they, they don't want to sell it to you, and that's their right. That's not their right. They are not the owners of Walmart. Corporate says that if the item is on the sales floor, I have the right to buy it. If it's on the sales floor, I can buy it. It's not, they are not, they are, they can be replaced. They are employees. They are not owners. They can be replaced. Show me in your corporate policy. Show me in your Walmart part, part, policy, excuse me, policies that says that I cannot purchase this item. The only time you can't purchase an item if the item pop up and says a recall item. So show me in your policy that states that I cannot purchase this item just because you fail to do your job. So then the other thing that hit me with this, this officer. Once he kind of put out there that, you know, she can be arrested, she actually tried to leave several times. She did. She tried to leave several times. She was like, just let me go. Just let me leave. He was the one that said, no, I got to do paperwork. I got to document it. I got to, oh, I need your ID. It was him. Then he going to say, well, I gave you several chances to leave. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. <laughs> the fact, maybe I'll, and, and like I said, I don't know everything about laws and all that other stuff. I will admit that. But I'm confused with the whole trespassing because they basically charging her with trespassing as if she knew she was not allowed at Walmart and she came there anyway. Once you said, okay, she had to leave. You didn't want her there no more. Y'all should have allowed her to leave. Me personally, I feel like she shouldn't even have a trespassing on charge. For what? She, what did she do? Try to buy three cent item? 
And y'all got mad because she she caused a scene because she did cause a scene. I ain't gonna lie, she did cause a scene because <laughs> I'm sorry. That whole help me, help me, TikTok, help me, help me, TikTok. I'm like, oh lord, TikTok can't help you, girl. What? They did share your video. Your video did went viral. I and I guess that can count as help. Okay, because now everybody know about the situation. At least 90% of the people is on your side. I'm the one of the people that's on your side. <laughs> so, maybe that helped because you did go viral. But, in the, mid in the middle of the store, I don't think I would have done that. I don't think I would have done that. But my thing is, even though her causing a little scene, still don't excuse the way they treated her. It still don't excuse the way they treated her. That officer should get in trouble because he was biased from, from the moment he came in there. He was biased. He wasn't even willing to really listen to her. And I understand she have an accent. And I understand as women, and I say as women, we get emotional. We, we, we get in our feelings. She probably was talking a little fast. She might have raised her voice a little bit because in a situation like that, you can't get in your feelings. Even a man probably would get in his feelings if he feel like he being mistreated about the situation. So... I understand it. I understand that maybe he didn't like her tone. He didn't like that she was. He felt like she was over talking him or whatever the case may be. But I felt like he still, as an officer, should have been able to listen to both sides of the story. He automatically sat with their employees before anything. He automatically sat um uh, sat with the employees. That's my opinion. All of this is just my opinion. I felt like he automatically sided with the employees. And that he did not really give her a chance to tell her side of the story or to say anything. All, oh, well, it, that's their, what you call it. If they don't want to sell it, they don't have to. That's not how corporate work. That's This is not their company. I don't understand this whole privately owned stuff. But they don't mean that it's the employee company. And the employees decide what they want to do. Because they are replaced. They can be getting, um, Walmart can get rid of them and replace them in a heartbeat. They are just another employee, just another person. They are not as special as they think they are. But let me know how you feel about this reaction. I know it's a little long because I also, you know, I got to get my commentary. <laughs> So, anyway, this is your Mama Coupon. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Please follow me on Instagram, TikTok, you know, and all that other good stuff. Like this video, share this video, and do all those things that people tell you to do at the end of the video. You already know what to do. Wash your hands, wash your body, wash everything. Just stay clean out there and also be safe. If you're interested in being support to my channel, just like, comment, share, or hit the join button. Also, I do personalized finding. That link is in the description box below. You already know. Be safe out there. Be safe out there. Be safe out there. Anyway, bye. <laughs>